Hello, I'm Mr Cook, Head of Humanities at the Holgate Academy and I'd like to tell you about AQA GCSE Geography. So I'll start with a quote, without geography you know where and this is from John, <laughs> Dr John Hopkin and I think he's been slightly flippant but basically what he was saying was that geography is a study of the world and what's going on in the world and to study geography gives you that knowledge of what's going on uh, and allows you to understand the way the world works but also to have those skills to interact with the world so geography is really important So, what skills will you gain doing GCSE Geography? And that's what's really important when you look at geography. It's a skills based subject. Essentially, you'll be looking at analysis, how to look at different bits of information, evaluate them. Communication, 
you'll be looking at how you talk about these things, written communication, specifically looking at some of the ICT skills. We look at um, some statistical work, which we then use Excel to produce. Writing for purpose. So we'll be looking at different ways of writing, depending on what you want to get across. Writing a report, writing a long answer, a short answer. You'll be working in teams. You'll be presenting things to the rest of the class. You'll get some place knowledge. You'll learn about more of that world that we live in. You'll be doing some problem solving. As we talked about in Unit 3, we have a bit of an issue evaluation where you've got to solve a problem and find a solution. And finally, you'll be investigating things, finding things out. Lots of really useful skills. So once you've got those skills, what do geographers do? Now, um, geographers uh, are a bit odd in a way because geography is a subject that sits between all the different subjects quite nicely. And as a consequence, geographers do everything. And we seem to be called the jack of all trades, but we are the masters of some. And what that means is because of the skills we learn in geography, people like geographers, okay? And they go and do all kinds of jobs. Geography goes with everything. It goes with English. It goes with them, um, more arts-based subjects, but it also goes with the sciences and maths. Um, and some of my peers have been things as odd as uh, physios at Bolton Wonders Football Club. Some of them have been geography teachers. Some of them work in Australia doing disaster management, very geography-based jobs. Other ones, though, work for management consultancy firms in London. So geographers could go out and do any job they really want to and have and do do. So why choose geography? As I've said in the other subjects, you must like it to choose it. And that's the single most important factor when you're picking subjects. If you don't enjoy them, you won't work hard and you won't do well in them. If you want to understand more about the world you live in, you want to find out about new places, about things that are happening, to get under the skin of the planet you live in. You want a subject that bridges the sciences and the arts, that you can work with both of those types of subjects. Geographers are also incredibly employable. They're the second most popular with employers behind maths. So employers really like that GCSE geography. And finally, it's a linear academic subject. So it's a subject that you want to do that will have exams at the end that you will work and acquire the knowledge over two years and then sit that subject at the end. So if you like what you hear and you're interested, maybe you want to take geography. Thank you for listening.